Good morning, y'all. It's Sarah Bo. Welcome back to another weekly vlog. I have quite a bit of things this week, so I'm really excited to show you them. But basically, it's the morning on Monday. I just got out of my first class, which is econ. That's the only class I have for today, so I'm actually gonna go head to the gym. I wore my workout clothes as motivation that I would go to the gym. So I'm gonna try to work on that because I want to get back into like a healthy mindset because just got back from spring break and all the food was eaten and none of the exercise was done <laughs> so we really need to work on that so i'm gonna head to the gym um later tonight i have chapter i also have two exams on wednesday that i need to study for and then i have a bunch of greek life stuff this weekend i have a leadership conference and things like that you know all the fun stuff so i have a lot going on this week and i'm so happy you decided to join if you do enjoy this video remember to thumbs up and subscribe below and let's just get into the week by the way not sponsored by nike wish i were but also i have 600 subscribers so not happening but <laughs> this is my workout outfit it's literally all nike i got some new workout stuff i've had this sports bra for like probably like five now four somewhere around eighth grade ninth grade kind of awkward i'm a college freshman at ohio state university if you didn't know the ohio state university just kidding y'all anyways um then i have this tank top i bought this over spring break and i love it it like is open in the back if you can see that like dang look at her non-existent back muscles i just love tank tops like this especially that are flowy because they like hide the flub and then i have these leggings they're like not the sucky in ones because i don't like those ones with like the big band i just like the ones that are like super thin and feel like spandex so that's what those are and then my nike shoes so that's the workout outfit of the day i'm gonna go to the gym and probably not film because i'm very anxious and don't like looking like a youtuber we're back from the gym and redressed into the style i would like to brand as kindergarten chic Guys, I just hung up the bunny banner. It's everything. Sarah Bunny has her bunnies! Sarah Bunny lives on. It looks super cute. Also, I got this plant. So, we're thriving. We're thriving in room. We won't tell you, but you know, the room number that we're in that we always say. <laughs> okay, so I want to film a music video. So I've been like singing, but like the acoustics in here that aren't that good. So like, Maybe I posted a music video, maybe I didn't. I don't know, it'll go up before this vlog because I need a video for tomorrow and I'm not being inconsistent. But also I should definitely be studying for my exams, but oops. Okay, so fun part of like my recording process, if you were curious, I'm still the most amateur, but um, I use this microphone. The reason I got it was because like Dodie recommended it. She has really good vocals and a really good sound. So I figured, probably be a good option. It does. It works great. It's better than my shotgun mic for music, so I use this one for music, and then I use my shotgun mic almost never now, <laughs> um, just because it's a lot to carry around on a camera, and this camera has decent audio on its own, but for music I use this, and then I can plug my headphones in and listen to it back, so I just recorded the song tonight. That's one of my original songs, and it should have already been posted, so if you want to go check it out, you should. I write original country music, and I play gigs in the summer, and it's like my dream to be a singer slash songwriter. Anyways, I'll leave my original songs posted out below, um, so yeah, looking forward to that. LMAO outfit change because I totally forgot chapter was formal, so now I'm wearing like the sweater and the skirt, and I need to like tuck this in or figure it out somehow, but I don't really have time, so I'm gonna go head to chapter dinner, <laughs> um, but yeah gonna go meet my friends in the union okay first of all same outfit as yesterday because <laughs> i only wore it for like a couple hours and then i realized chapter was formal so i had to change out of it into like heels and stuff because we had a badge returning ceremony tomorrow because like, i'm getting initiated this weekend which is exciting and obviously i can't take you through that because that's like what makes me kappa is like that we have rituals and stuff that i can't take you to but anyways um i had my first class this morning i got breakfast before that went to class then worked on getting my YouTube video uploaded in the library, and then I went to lunch. Now it's a little bit past noon, almost one, and I have so much to work on. Shouldn't be awful, but <laughs> it's definitely not gonna be fun. So definitely have a busy day tomorrow, so I need to get everything done. I'm done with classes for today, and then I have a extra credit thing I'm going to tonight with my friend slash sorority sister, Trisha. It's called like a business generating good summit and we get like five extra credit points if we write a port on it and go lots of things to do so i need to get a ton of stuff done anyways 
tonight was uploaded i'll leave it linked down below i really hope you enjoyed i'm literally wearing the same outfit i wore in it, so you know i'm gonna go get my work done and stop putting it off by vlogging so that's the plan also wait one more second of procrastination i got these two shirts look i want to show you so I got this muscle tee. We ordered that through universities. And then this one, which is really cool because it was made by a local company that actually hires um, autistic people to help them with the t-shirts. It's also very cute. And yeah, I love supporting that because my little sister has autism. So like, I was trying to support that community. Two really cute shirts. I'm understanding what people say when they are like, you'll get like 10,000 shirts from being a sorority because I've only been in it for like a couple months now and I have like eight, so. to go get breakfast before class. I have two today. I didn't vlog yesterday just because I had three classes and an exam, so it was just a lot. But I'm going to get breakfast now and should be a good day. A lot less busy than yesterday, so that should be a lot more fun. So if you're wondering how I spent today, I bought like a ton of stickers on Redbubble. Anyways, I have actually not done a lot today. I just had my two classes. It's about four o'clock. I um, got out of my classes and just kind of like watched videos and chilled. But me and my friends are going to go to the mall because I need to get a swimsuit for summer break. I just want to go to Aerie and we don't have one in my hometown. So might as well get one out. And then I need to get some more business professional clothing because Fisher loves me to dress up. Also wearing the adorable girl power shirt. I kind of love it the most. I probably won't vlog a lot because like my friends don't always want to be on vlogs and I don't want to be like pushy or weird or you know, you know I'm just nervous. So. What up? It's Friday. I always film here because the lighting is just the best in my room. I just got out of an 8 a.m. Um, yesterday I did go shopping and get quite a few things so I kind of wanted to show you because it's just fun and then also tonight and tomorrow we have some fun things going on that I thought I'd update you about. I have a class in about two hours. I definitely need to like clean my room so I'm gonna get to that soon. Basically the first thing I wanted to say is tomorrow I have initiation so obviously I'm not bringing my camera or anything through that. I can say like I have not been hazed and I'm really like proud of my sorority for that. I, I know that's like a really low bar to set but like you know it's 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 not like a super high standard to not haze but a lot of organizations still do it and that's something you should be aware of and fight against if you are in the Greek system but I'm really proud that my organization has not done that so just thought I should mention that I want to do like a whole video on Greek stuff so yeah I'm going there tomorrow to get initiated I'm really excited I'm so excited to be like an official member of Kappa Kappa Gamma that's just really cool and I can't wait to be a part of it so excited about that oh and then the other thing I wanted to talk to you about was that we have grown so much in the past like couple days slash like weeks i went to florida for spring break i did not vlog it because i was just chilling with my grandparents and my brother when i was going to florida we were at like 480 something subscribers and by the time i left we were at like 600 subscribers and now we're at like 680 which is just blowing my mind which is like i know it's not a lot for youtube but it's it just means a lot to me especially because it's growth in the smaller days yeah it just means a lot to me so thank you i really appreciate it i'm gonna keep trying to post good videos make good content if you're just starting youtube let this show you that like consistency is key um the minute i started posting consistent videos is when i saw that growth so very excited about that um thank you so much again thank you thank you so much Let's get into the haul then. <laughs> so first I got things from Aerie. I love Aerie. I know their bathing suits are expensive. Like one bathing suit costs me like $50, which is ridiculous. But I really, really support their message. I just think they're a good company. Um, I love that they have really taken to making like realistic models. Even as someone like me, okay, when I look at like plus size models, 90% of the time they have that hourglass body shape still where they still have like skinny waist and like big butt big boobs like but aries definitely drifting away from that and they have like all different body shapes um they have girls with disabilities people with scars and they're not photoshopping them out and all those things like are just really special to me so i'm 
I'm just glad to support them because I love their models and I love how they show things on different body types, not just different body sizes, if that makes sense. So I did get one bathing suit, um, but it's really good quality. So here we have it. I got high-waisted yellow bottoms and then I got this bikini top which is very cute so really excited to wear this in the summer obviously I'm always away but I don't have an area anywhere close to my hometown so this was the closest I was going to get and from Express I just got some like I got my lady suit um yeah just things for like interviews and stuff so I got these kitten heels um that are pointed and then I got the pants I don't really care if y'all know my size but I'm a 10 regular in these and these are the mid-rise ankle ones, and I thought they were very cute. Um, the 8 kind of fit, but the 10 just felt more comfortable, so I don't know. I don't really care about size, because it's all arbitrary for women anyways. Like, have we ever had something consistent across the board? No. Just wear what fits you. And then I just got a basic white top, and this is in a medium. Obviously, you wear a blazer over this, otherwise... It's not business professional, but and all that jazz. And that was way more than I wanted to spend on business professional clothes, but they're staples, so it's fine. <laughs> I'm gonna use them. Amidst the cleaning, I totally forgot to mention, I asked her to get these things from Charlotte Russe. So it's really sad that they're closing, but they do have a lot of sales going on right now. Um, so I got two pairs of earrings, and then I also got these sunglasses for game days next year. Pretty hype about these, they're pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna continue cleaning my room and go do some laundry right now. morning it is Sunday and it's actually about 9 15 I want to say I'm headed over to get breakfast um, because the only place open is across campus <laughs> but I'm headed to go get breakfast and then I have a Greek leadership um, kind of like conference thing today really excited about that so I haven't vlogged the past couple days honestly we had initiation and then we had a bunch of other stuff so it's been really fun though, so I'm gonna go to this and then we also have a programming event for like mental health in my sorority, so I'm gonna go to that too. Lots of things going on, I'm gonna get it done today, so that's the update. Well, that didn't go as planned, <laughs> so basically it's a lot later. Um, honestly, today was just super busy. I went straight from our Buckeye Greek leadership thing more on that in a second, to the programming um, education thing from Kappa, which was really cool. We talked a lot about mental health and everything, so that was really cool, but I did not get much done today. Um, I've just been really tired this whole weekend, um, from initiation to that, to just like everything going on. So there's a lot going on, but it has also been a really cool week. So for example, today at the Buckeye Greek Leadership um, event, that we had it was something we applied for um and three kappas got in and there were about 30 people from all different greek organizations pha and phc um ifc i don't know the names of all of them so if i'm forgetting one sorry <laughs> in case you weren't aware multicultural and special interest ones like music and things like that are all um different forms of greek life so definitely look into those if you don't think you're into the like social ones but anyways so she was talking to us the lady goes yeah we're gonna watch this video and puts on this video of Ohio State football and I was like okay like literally every two seconds out of the school you will get some kind of inspirational Ohio State football thing not that I don't love it and I was like okay this is kind of weird like it doesn't relate at all like I get this is a leadership conference but what so that plays for about 10 minutes and then she goes you've probably guessed our speaker Braxton Miller <laughs> walks in um he was our quarterback and then wide receiver a couple years back and he also is in the nfl now yeah it's just it was cool to 
hear from somebody like that. So he came and talked to us. Then we got pictures. I look like trash in the pictures, so let's not talk about it. But um, it's cool. We got him to do the Kappa sign. He was a really cool dude. Um, it was just really cool. He was super nice and he had some good advice uh, and just seemed like a genuine person. So it was a great day and then went to write to the mental health thing. And that was also great. Um, just talking with sisters about encouraging each other to talk about mental health and not stigmatize it and things like that. So now I'm just getting ready for tomorrow um, in the week ahead. So I'm gonna like get all my clothes sorted out so I have an outfit for tomorrow. I'm gonna get my planner out and work on some stuff and I think that will be it. So thank you so much for tuning into this vlog. Sorry if it was a little all over the place and I wasn't necessarily so consistent but I really do appreciate your viewership and thank you so much because tonight we just hit 700 subscribers kind of crazy I'm so excited about it thank you for your viewership and everything I appreciate it more than you could know um yeah so I hope you have an amazing day also follow me on instagram at yt cerebo kind of weird to follow it up with that. um and subscribe and join the fam if you want to it's really fun we have a lot of fun over here. Can't think of other words than fun. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna head out. Night. Oh, you're not sleeping. <laughs> I'll see you guys next week. Bye.